Well, hello and welcome. It has been more than half a century since we've had a mainstream speed up in air travel. But during this time, we've made incredible advancements in the foundational technologies for designing, developing, and building aircraft. We have advanced aerodynamics, new materials, and significantly more efficient engines. And today marks a historic milestone at Boom, as we have brought these technologies together for the first time to build a new generation of faster aircraft, of speed in service of greater human connection. And along the way, we have set the principles and the foundation, not just for the technical design of future aircraft, but how we approach our mission in general. We've established our principles of speed, safety, and sustainability without compromise. And we've begun to pave the path toward a mainstream supersonic future. Today we stand here on the precipice of a new age of travel. And I am so proud to announce, Supersonic is here. history's first independently developed supersonic jet. Every feature of this airplane has been optimized for high-speed performance, and everything we've learned from the aircraft has directly informed the design and development of our Overture passenger airliner. Stretching 71 feet in length, its fuselage is designed for speed, minimizing drag and supersonic performance. Its carbon composite airframe retains its rigidity and strength, even under the temperatures and pressures of high-speed flight. XB-1's Delta Wing balances low-speed performance for takeoff and landing with high-speed efficiency. Three J85 engines designed by General Electric propel it to break through supersonic speeds. Its ergonomic cockpit was designed with our test pilots in the loop, with hundreds of hours of human factors analysis and usability testing. Its nose, where the air first meets the airplane, has a refined shape to generate the precise vortex flow to ensure stability across a wide range of airspeeds. 